Hello everyone, it's Miros and today we will compare these two devices Huawei P60 Pro and Huawei P50 Pro and especially Huawei P60 Pro using EMUI 13.1 and here we have Huawei P50 Pro using Harmony OS version 4 latest and greatest for both devices so without further ado, let's check them now let's check the versions and see what we have here settings and settings let's scroll down about phone and about phone here so what we have we have here huawei p60 pro and here we have huawei p50 pro you can see this is the chinese version and this is the european version software version we have emui version 13.1.0 here we have harmony os version 4 and this is the latest update from yesterday 112 which brings lots of new optimization so guys first let's lock the screens and check if there is any difference in lock screens and always on displays let's just lock them you can see we have the same melting effect here it is live wallpaper and here we have something similar what is the real difference here in always on display this is with Harmony OS version 4 latest update we have now the option to change the clonk font this is something new coming from yesterday so let's now go to lock screens and you can see here we have the standard emui or huawei lock screen and here we have the new lock screen coming with yesterday update of harmony os and here this is uh, specifically the poster team i just uh, enable it but you can enable here a different teams but you can see now we have the option here to change the clock font i will show you that after a minute so without further ado let's unlock the devices and go to home screen here on the harmony os notification center also gets an overhaul with the option to divide incoming alerts based on your preference users can also pin their preferred app notifications and interact with them directly from the notification center without opening the app so this is something coming here to harmony os notifications are a little bit improved not something big keep in mind that because i already have a video comparing uh, harmony os and emui but today i will just uh, compare the new things coming with harmony os 4 which are more of a visual features and we will let you decide which one will suit you better until we are at the home screen let's check here more options we have what we have here wallpaper service widget transitions and home screen settings here we have wallpaper service widget layout transition and home screen so we have here a new layout original layout and we have here the option sort by color if you select that you can select a new layout just sorted directly from huawei by a color let's check it here you can see more colorful like uh, bluish are moved here on the right side we have here more reddish and greenish icons also we have here the option sort by category if you select that you can see again and also you can change here the categories it is just uh, the standard apps are here uh, applications which are similar to each other you can just select from a different category i will leave it to original layout swipe again and check the service widgets here we have customizable widgets that's a new option so we have a different clock styles here let's go and check the clocks here this is what you have on emui 30 but these are the clocks coming to harmony os version 4 and you can see how different they are also you have a picture frames here we have a different signature occasion like memories twilight of course everything is in chinese and we just have a lot more and even better if you tap for example on the clock you can select a different colors for the background of the clock just hit up and let's go and check what we have on the home screen you can select a different color combos for this clock so slowly huawei are moving to material you Teming coming with Android 13 I think it was and here we miss that future. With Harmony OS version 4 Huawei implement something they call it Live Window which is a Huawei take on Apple's Dynamic Island. Here supported apps will show real time alerts and notifications in a pew shaped icon on the corner of your device here and I will show you that. 
let me just open the clock here let's open a timer give it a time and just hit play and now here on emui when the timer is working if you go to your home screen nothing happened you will receive that timer here but nothing more but if we and you can see this is just an icon and if we hit play button here on a timer and if we go to home screen you can see what's happened here we have that live window we have that so-called live window and of course if you just single tap here it will expand just like on apple ios it's uh, their dynamic island let's move it back and here it is if you want to go inside the app just tap one more time and it will directly go to the application itself and if you go to home screen you can see that beautiful animation it is going to the upper left corner if you tap it it will expand bigger that's the new life window which uh, is working only with uh, stock supported applications like clock and so on but of course it will expand to more applications in the future and let's move to the most important visual change coming with harmony os version 4 you probably already can see that material you which i speaking about all the stock icons are with the same color and let's move and show you what happened here so if you go here in home screen and wallpaper now here it's home screen and wallpaper and here it is home screen and style because it is way more of a style now we have here teams option and if you tap here on teams if you tap here on the teams you can see you just have variety of teams installed here on your device pre-installed but if you tap here now you have that's something new art star from magazine poster headline immersive weather which is something new and also the emoji team and what's new about these teams here if you tap here on immersive weather you can see what happened nice animation again let's download it you can personalize it let's tap on it you can select life effect duration which is now set to five seconds i will leave it to default you can select here a different weather conditions for clear cloudy overcast foggy and so on let's hit apply and just check what's happened with this team and now it's pre-applied here and I'm on the home screen you can see I have here a beautiful ocean and water and let's lock the screen and check how it's look like on the you can see how it's look like on the lock screen now for that weather conditions because now in my region here it is very clear this is the immersive weather widget let's go again and check the other teams which we have art star which is something new So let's personalize it and now here you can see select a portrait you like and pick a wallpaper to go with it so you can select here a different uh, wallpaper this is something like the apple ios 16 option with the clock and so on so you can select here a different pattern for the background pattern colors you can select this one for example if you select this pattern color you can see immediately the clock is changed you can leave it green immediately the clock is going black if you select like this it will go white you can see a very material you options and also the important here are the icon colors let's tap on info button extract colors from wallpaper to create matching icons that's exactly what material you is doing with android let's select this one for example and you can see here the preview generating a preview you can see what's happened how it's melting into the aod and how it's opening and go to the home screen let's apply it and check what will happen and we have different presets with these teams let's wait a minute and now we are here on our home screen and you can see the animations these are just the best animations i ever see on any 
device better than the iOS 17 and soon I will make a comparison. Let's lock the screen. You can see what's happened, how this portrait is going to the AOD. Let's just open it and you can see how it is expanded. Very, very nice animation. Let's wait it a minute and check what will happen. And now it's going to the AOD. Let's unlock again. Finally, we have something like Material U in Huawei devices. It is still in Harmony OS, but of course, probably in the future it will came to EMUI. I'm not sure, probably EMUI 14 or it will came with uh, EMUI 13.5 with Huawei Mate 60 Pro, but we need to wait and see. What we have here different, we have that headline theme. And if you hit on personalize, you can see again something which we receive with Android 14. And here I just want to mention that I hate that inconsistency in colors in Huawei devices. I'm here in Teams and you can see everything is with black uh, background. I enable the white team, not the dark team, but it is still with a black background, which is absolutely inconsistent. Here is the standard uh, wallpaper. You can edit it. You can edit here the touch and hold to move the image. You can put it down just to move it wherever you want in that circle and you can see how it's moving here you can see you have the clock you can uh, you have here the notifications under the clock and the date but you can change now the clock style just like on ios just like on android 14 so this time huawei just create something interesting for us and you have here also the icon colors again a different combos with the colors let's apply it and you can see these combos here for the icons let's lock the device again you can see here now this uh, new font with the clock and it is here too on the lock screen very nice very different let's just tap here on that poster team personalize it and you have here a different combos with the clocks you can see it and also template color you can change the whole template color here we, and you have a bunch of printed out ones also icon colors again matching with the color of your wallpaper and theme color emoji theme which is again coming with the newest version of android 14 for pixel devices this is the emoji wallpaper and the whole team with it. Let's tap on personalize and you can see you can select here a different emojis to match your wallpaper. And of course you can also select a different icon colors, different combos. And let's apply it to check what we have with these emoji wallpapers. It is just creating now this wallpaper with different emojis. And bam, you have it here. Emoji wallpaper here. Let's lock the device. You can see how they are made, melting and going into the AOD and very beautiful animation. Just I want to show you that again. You can see what happened with these emojis. Let's unlock the device. So finally, finally, Huawei are becoming more interactive and more user friendly and give us more options just for fun. And these were the biggest visual improvements coming with Harmony OS over the EMUI 13. And of course guys probably Huawei will update EMUI devices with these new features but we will need probably two or three months or at least this Harmony OS to, to go in stable version because it's still in beta. And that was it guys don't forget if you like this video or content like this subscribe to my channel and like my videos thanks for watching and have a nice day